Dear friends, this is part 3 of 20 questions out of 100 questions with answers for boiler operators and other technical boiler staff. Please subscribe this channel for more technical and informative videos and stay connected with us. 1. What is the reasons for monitoring of oxygen level in flue gases? To control combustion and to achieve maximum efficiency of combustion by optimizing excess air. 2. What are the functions of steam drum? Steam drum acts as water storage device. Separates steam and water. Provides space for internal chemical treatment. Removes sludge from boilers through blowdown. Accommodates safety valves to relieve excess pressure during abnormal operating conditions. 3. What is the function of startup vents in boilers? To control steam pressure during abnormal operating conditions. To provide minimum flow through superheater coils. To increase main steam temperature during low loads. 4. Why steam drum dish end thickness is lesser than that of cylindrical portion. Its reason is because stress produced in dish ends are circumferential and are less as compared to stress developed in longitudinal portion. 5. What do you mean by an equivalent evaporation? Quantity of water evaporated at 100 degree centigrade to dry saturated steam at 100 degree centigrade. 6. What are the reasons for more main steam temperature? More excess air. High moisture fuel. More convective heat transfer at superheater zone due to loss of turbulence. Failure of a temperator control valve. Boiler temperators are used to fine tune or control steam temperature from a boiler, as well as the steam temperature between boiler stages. Operating the boiler at lower feed water temperature at economizer inlet. 7. Why it is been not recommended to give blowdown during high steaming rates? Sudden opening of IBD valves or water wall bottom header valves will affect circulation rate and may lead to failure of water wall tubes. 8. Why deaerators are placed at higher elevation? To give NPSH, negative pressure suction head, to boiler feed pumps. 9. What are the functions of deaerator? To remove dissolved oxygen. To store the feed water. To increase the feed water temperature. To give NPSH, negative pressure suction head, to boiler feed pumps. Allows space for LP dosing, oxygen scavenger dosing. 10. More height of chimney creates what? Creates more natural draft and helps to reduce load on ID fans. 11. What is the function of draft system? To force air for combustion. To expel out products of combustion from boiler. 12. What are the different types of drafts used in boilers? Forced draft. Induced draft. And. Balanced draft. 13. On what factors chimney construction depends? Quantity of flue gas generated per hour. Draft to be produced. Sulfur content in fuel. And. Environment clearance. 14. Why the ID fans are not situated between air preheater and electrostatic precipitators. If placed between air preheater and electrostatic precipitators. Fan size increases due to higher specific volume of gases. As flue gas volume decreases as its temperature decreases. 15. Where do you use steel chimneys? For economy at lower flue gas flow steel chimneys are more preferred. 16. What is the velocity of flue gas inside the chimney? It is 10 to 14 meter per second. 17. What is the velocity of flue gas inside the electrostatic precipitators? It is around 0.75 to 1 meter per second. 18. 
What factors affect the draft produced in chimneys? Flue gas temperature and air temperature. 19. What is the velocity of wind considered for boiler construction? Around 39 meter per second. 20. What do you mean by cold air inversions in chimney? It happens when outside air pressure is more than flue gas pressure inside the chimney. Dear friends, hope you enjoyed this part 3 session of Boilers Questions and Answers. Please hit like icon to encourage us to make this channel more effective. Please subscribe this channel for more technical and informative videos. Thank you and good luck.